working again from the Goyang Technology. Today, my topic is about the Kumpuman coating inspection process. Before I start my presentation, actually, I made a block with the map. Today, this morning, probably my section is the end of the presentation session today. So three or four guys remains here. So I will do the presentation only for the four to five guys. But it is more than 10 times I expected. So thank you for you are remaining here and listening my presentation. The Goyong Technology has released the DPI system dispensing process inspection system to the market last year. This system is designed to measure the transparent material, such as kumpuma coating material, underfill material, or glue, LCD component, transparent material. We can measure the thickness. The Goyang technology really focusing on the 3D measurement from SPI and AY until to the DPI system. I have always, you know, starting the question when I deal with a certain topic, why? It is came to here as well. Why 3D is the method in terms of dispensing process control? Because everyone knows the answer. Because Goyang has to introduce the, the importance of the 3D measurement data since 2002, when Goyang introduced to you the concept of 3D inspection of the filter paste. Because quality is the matter, the 3D measurement is important. I'm gonna tell you why. The inspection system is telling you how good you are. And also, inspection system is telling you how bad you are as well. However, inspection system together with the 3D measurement data is telling you where you are good and where you are bad. It has your lots of things. You know the point where you need to optimize. You, you know the point where you need to be more focused on that. There is a reason why 3D measurement data is really critical in the inspection area. That is the one of the success factor from the Goyang technology, from the SPNAY. I would like to continue this successful business story to the DPI system as well. All knows that compromise coating, the thickness, is really, really critical. Too thin or too thick, lots of defect uh, will be followed. Too thin, the compromise coating, uh, thickness bring the de electronic strain too thick, also cracking, wrinkling, also making lots of bubbles because the thickness is too thick. However, what is the problem to control the thickness of the compromise coating? I have questions, so I approach to the different end user doing automotive, military, aircraft, and industrial area. BMW, Audi, Mercedes, and also aircraft, military group in France, military group in Italy, and also military group in America. The answer from the customer was the same. They would like to control the thickness of Kumpuma coating for every single board from their side. However, they could not find the equipment which can measure the Kumpuma coating thickness for every single board. <coughs> they really like to control the thickness of compromise coating. However, there was no equipment to measure every single board for the thickness of compromise coating. The compromise coating comes to the automotive, the increase of necessity because of the electronic vehicle. Electronic vehicle requires more the electronic circuit board, and also if it comes to the autonomous driving, it requires lots of GPU, CPU, or advanced technologies inside in the circuit board. All requires the coating protection, and also the thickness measure, thickness control is becoming really critical not only from the automotive, but also from industrial, or the RF module, and also aircraft, and also military sector as well. 
So one of the stories on the automotive from the Goya history, as I told you, the end user customer is really, really trying to make every single move, the coating thickness. However, they cannot really push to their subcontractor to check out every single board from my coating inspection system because they know there is no equipment can do that. However, from the America last year, there was well known the electric vehicle manufacturer. I cannot say the name, but the best electric car. They found us and then they found they told us that this is the system, the Goyang Neptune system, this is the system they are looking for. There is a reason why we are de delivering last of system to the America, Southeast Asia, in, and also I would like to bring this business into Europe as well. Because I'm pretty sure the same requirement, same need will be in Europe. And also last year, I also witnessed lots of cases in Europe, it is already uh, coming to the production site, measuring every single board from my coating thickness. <coughs> the Goyang Neptune system is able to measure transparent material by having the lift technology developed by the Goyang R&D Center Medical Department. Goyang technology having two different R&D center and business department. One is for the SMP, the other one is the medical business. The medical business department having the fluid tomography together with the laser interferometry. This looks really long sentence and even I have no clue what technology is it, but I can give you some examples. Fluid tomography is widely used, used, used in the hospital. You may hear the CT or MRI. The fluid tomography is using an CT MRI. What means for me, this technology is delivering the accurate data. Okay, at the beginning of my presentation, I told you the importance of 3D measurement data into inspection system. <coughs> My second topic here is that, okay, you have the system producing 3D measurement data, then what about the data? Is it really accurate? If you are starting to analyze and focus on your defect, having rubbish 3D measurement data, then your analyze becoming the rubbish. However, if you are having Variable accurate 3D measurement data, your analysis based on the 3D measurement data becoming more valuable. That's the point here. We are using the same technology from the CT and MRI, delivering the accurate data, because if something happened, not measuring proper from CT and MRI related to the health, human health, it brings a huge impact. So this technology allows the Goyang Neptune system delivering you the accurate data. It means that Goyang Neptune delivering you trustful 3D measurement data into inspection system. So by having this technology, Goyang Neptune system is able to measure without disrupt the PCB, the coating thickness, and also it really, really fast to, to measure the thickness. So when I have a test with a sample board, there is the 2D and 3D inspection, uh, inspection category within our system. But when I turn off the 3D inspection condition, the cycle time is not really, really different. I have tested 200 by 300 millimeter PCB, having seven to eight point to measure the thickness together with the 2D UV lighting inspection condition. There is the cycle time difference, only 2D and 2D and plus 2D plus 3D, 0.5 seconds. So even if you turn on the measurement for the 3D, the cycle time is not really increasing. So here is the product lineup of Goyang Neptune system. The micro, microscope solution as an offline system, we have 
uh, core selection team, and also we are having inline solutions just like the SPNAY, the conveyor transportation, we call the napkin sector. By having new green lighting within our system, we can inspect the two EV facts such as coating area, splash, and also bubble. I will jump into the bubble algorithm later because we are using the AI technology into that algorithm. And also, we are having 3D module can measure the coating thickness in real time. This is another advantage I just mentioned before. We are utilizing AI uh, technology into bubble detection algorithm. Why it is important here? I realized and Goyang Tech Task Force realized that by having different environment into your conformal coating process, such as different different coloring process, different materials, or different light, or whatever it is, the different environments uh, impact on the shape of the bulb shape of the bubble. So one factory having uh, kind of this kind of circle bubble, but the other factory having different environment, that different shape of the bubble. So that is the reason why we are using AI technology into that algorithm, because even if you are having different shape of the design of the bubble, we are capturing the image and it is we are doing the image learning by our AI engine and it adapting to the algorithm itself. It means that we can optimize the bubble algorithm into your environment. So whatever your environment and producing the whatever the shape of the bubble, our algorithm is learning the images and shape and then it will be implemented into the uh, bubble detect algorithm. And also software, we just released the product last year. The software design and ease of use is really, really good. So one of the biggest feedback from our existing customer, ease of use of the software, easy to understand, easy to operate. And also the Neptune system is designed to measure the transparent material. We are able to measure not only conformal coating, but also underfill material and also glue material as well. Because of the underfill inspection system, the challenging is that the customer wants to check the fillet with this and fillet height of the underfill material underneath of CFP component. By having the measurement capability, we are able to measure the height and also by having the, the algorithm to distinguish the underfill stick, underfill bullet, we are checking the whether it is properly dispensed underneath of the CFP component. So there are some examples and we can do the underfill by Neptune C plus system. The measurement range for the thickness, the minimum is the 10 micrometer up to 3.5 millimeter in air condition. Air condition means because of the different characteristic of transparent material in case of conformal coating. Conformal coating material having different refractive index. Refractive index impact on the measurement range. However, in air condition, our system is able to measure minimum 10 micrometer up to 3.5 millimeter. So this is the feedback from our existing customer easy of use to customer and reliable and delivering the accurate the measurement data into the inspection part. So for innovation from Goyang technology is the fighter, not a hitter. Because I learned this line from the Liz Trust yesterday from the BBC PMQ section. So I just utilize that. Goyang is the fighter for the innovation, really. We never give up. We are always looking for the innovation. So this is the end of my presentation. So thank you for your time today.